everyone talks about niching down and becoming a specialist and finding your um, market segment. While that's true, and by doing so, I know that it's, it's very easy to get your first few clients as, as an independent consultant. The, the real challenge is finding a market segment that is sustainable um, and one where you can really build a profitable consulting business. Now, the problem I find with, uh, with media in general and even on social media that uh, the industries that, are usually, um, that usually have the spotlight on them are, are glamorous and sexy industries like uh, you know, Fortune, Fortune 100 companies or uh, VC funded technology startups or the top 10 CPG brands for example and lots of consultants they sort of uh, they're attracted to these markets and they find you know they try and find niche within these markets while that is fine it's okay if that is your that that's where your your expertise lies that's just you know those markets are simply the tip of the iceberg um, there there are tons of markets uh, potentially profitable markets beneath the surface that just quietly go about their business, uh, but nobody talks about them, but they've got problems and they've got budgets. So it's important to not just niche down, but also find underserved markets that you can, uh, that you can go in and dominate. For example, for me, my market was um, research commercialization departments within universities that helped um, researchers launch their, launch their products, launch their you know, business ideas. So uh, I didn't know such departments even existed, but when I did, I doubled down and I made that my niche and they had lots of budgets and they had, lo they had a lot of, uh, uh, um, uh, they had a problem and they had budgets and they were looking for consultants. So that's where I built my business and nobody really talks about them uh, in the media. So the, the, uh, one of the things that I want to leave you with is that, you know, not, don't just niche down um, niching down will get you a couple of clients fast, that's not very hard, but uh, as a consultant, you're not just a service provider, you are a business owner, so you need to build a sustainable business over the long term, and if you want to do that, then uh, get curious about underserved markets, because that's where the real profits are. Thanks for watching, drop me a comment if you felt this was useful. I'll see you tomorrow.